What is that? Be careful. Think twice before you interact with anything in the Fragmentum. This is... Bronyas! Yeah, so she's... she's been here already? Whoa! Quick, look! That's Branya! Huh? Is that Kakolia too? No, it isn't them. It must be... a kind of echo? Some type of residual energy replicated by the Fragmentum. Which means they were definitely here, right? And it looks like they went that way! <laughs> Just in time. We had no idea which direction to take. Let's go. told me what this place is, Mother. Seven hundred years ago, this was Bellabog's northern border, and the site of an ancient battle. Here is where Elisa Rand led the first Silvermane guards in resistance against the Legion. Now, it is nothing more than an abandoned corridor, filled with the sounds of old world echoes. Don't let its fragmented appearance fool you, Bronya. On the day the promise is fulfilled, these ruins will become the breeding ground of a new world. Uh, Mother... Do you truly believe the Stellaron's promise? It summoned the blizzard beyond our walls and opened the door of the Fragmentum. It destroyed our civilization. It... And yet... The crime of our ancestors was their inability to embrace that destruction sooner. What? From the moment those intruders descended from beyond the sky, this world was handed a death sentence. But the Stellaron has reserved for us a thread of hope. There is a price to pay for new life, wiping away every decaying vestige of the old world, renouncing the meaningless and lingering struggle. This is the price the Stellaron demands. When the promise is fulfilled, Branya, no longer will we have to squander our lives guarding this wasteland. You and I will witness the new world rise from the ruins! No. This is a complex mechanism. How did they get past? Ah, I knew this wouldn't be simple. Oh, wait! Wasn't there some big energy hub-looking thing back in that empty area? Let's go back and take a look. Maybe it's linked to this gate. <sighs> I can't say I like the idea of interacting with our surroundings, especially this deep into the Fragmentum. However... However... There's no other way. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Huh. Even Don Hung the Sensible has his adventurous days. Right? But the gate didn't move an inch. Are there other units around? Hmm. It's clear that whoever designed these mechanisms didn't want outsiders to get through too easily. Let's keep looking for the energy hub. Look, 
Over there! I think I can see the next unit! Oh, I see it too. Let's go! Reach the end of the story in your own way. Hub? It seems like it. Huh. Strange. Fragmentum monsters would usually destroy man made objects. Did you hear that? This mechanism must be on now. Come on, let's find the next one! Where is the next mechanism? Oh, behind that gate! There's no switch. We need to find a way around. I've never seen such a desolate place. At least in Rivet Town, you could tell that people used to live there. Rivet Town is only at the outstretched fingertips of the corrosion. Now... We're deep in the Fragmentum's heart. I want to ask you a question. Do you still remember those dreams you mentioned to us? I know you're wide awake right now, but I need you to try. See if you can recall the voice you heard. This is merely speculation, but perhaps the voice you heard is the Stellaron somehow conveying information to Kokolia, and the one in your body is resonating with the Stellaron on this world. Huh? You mean that Stellarons can communicate? I've never heard that before. Well, there's never been a human that could accommodate a Stellaron in their body. Then, aren't we walking straight into a trap? <sighs> yes. And Branya may well be the bait. 
Don Hung's speculations are usually right on the money. But even if we've guessed right, we can't go home now. <laughs> There's no way back anyway. At least Kokolia won't catch us off guard now. So what if it's an ambush? We're not about to lose now. I have to save Branya, beat Kokolia, and crush this Stellaron thing to dust. want to get to the other side, we'll need to rotate the gear bridge again and go around. Closer to Branya. Let's move. Uh, are these echoes too? Yes. The fragmentum here seems to have made a special connection with Kokolia. It's repeatedly generating forms in her image. understand. Even if the truth is as you say, every generation of Guardian has resisted the call of the Stellaron. And all of them have been wrong, Mother. Do you still not see, Branya? There is no right or wrong here. Some of them acted out of human pride, others out of human short-sightedness. Our ancestors, including Elisa Rand, spent their whole lives trying to prolong this civilization. Then, after all fell still, their memories were scattered by the blizzard. They spent lifetimes writing songs of praise that lauded the bravery of humanity, but couldn't spare the time to gaze up into the stars! To those entities of greater magnificence in the heavens above, a thousand years is but a passing moment. The attainments of insignificant beings, nothing more than a footnote. I shall not follow the Guardian's misguided steps down that blind alley of narcissism. If persistence is futile, then one must choose a new beginning. But, Klipoth, the Preservation, are they not one of the magnificent entities you speak of? Is it not their strength that has sheltered Bellabog this entire time? The Preservation. 
preservation. Has the preservation ever looked humanity in the eye? Nothing more than an arrogant delusion of the architects. You will hear the real voice of magnificence, Branya. Then you will understand my choice. out. Tables and sentry posts? There must have been silver main guards stationed here once. If there were, they left a long time ago. <laughs> there might be valuable information here. Uh, shame we don't have time to look for it. Looks like another completely new monster! Considering where we are, it would be surprising if we didn't run into strange enemies here. I don't care how strange it is. It's blocking our way. Let's get it! <laughs> this will strengthen our position. <laughs> of the Fragmentum, I think we were fighting a human. Unlike those random low-level Fragmentum creations, this one seems to have a mind of its own. It seems to be able to use complex tactics. Look! Branya and Kokolia's echoes! They must have come through here. Uh, that means we must be really close, right? I sense that we're very near to the Northern Snow Plains. This is where the First Guardian led the Silvermane Guards into battle. She made huge sacrifices for the sake of... temporary respite. But the otherworldly legion did not tire. She soon realized that flesh and blood could not contend with so ruthless an enemy. When all was nearly lost, she chose to set her sights on the Stellaron, and made the first wish. As for what came later, you know as well as I. So... The Eternal Freeze was a disaster brought about by a human wish? <laughs> Ironic, no? All the Stellaron did was answer humanity's call. And yet we kept its existence a closely guarded secret for centuries. Even going so far as to attempt to use it to control the Stellaron. <sighs> Woeful. <laughs> Laughable. It? Now, well, something created using otherworldly technology. An inhibitor that a corporation from the old world and the architects attempted to use to house the Stellaron. <laughs> oh, I know you have many questions, my daughter. Be patient. Soon you will have all the answers. Reach the end of the story in your own way. This will strengthen our position. It's that shadow of hers again. But 
Branius isn't with her this time. It's only a fragmentum illusion. Let's get a closer look. It feels like this echo is different from the others before. Intruders! Uh, did... did she just speak? You cannot approach! Not good. March! Out the way! The Stellaron! Intruders! You go no further. Uh, are you sure this isn't the real her? Move carefully. It may you look like yourself? her, but the Fragmentum can only create forgeries. Bring her down! Or rock with it. My music. Conquer us all! You have the worst luck running into me. With me out here, how can we lose? Let's make it quick. Huh. Tremble before my power. You can't run! Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move! Clemency? Never heard of it. Turn up the volume! Stay right there while I give you a present! Let's go. How about this? A world devoured by ice! Rules are made to be broken! The Eternal Freeze will bury you. Step aside. I have no attacks now. The truth of life and death with this sanctuary is but a vision! This song's just for you. Keep up my tempo! Fight it or rock with it. My music. Conquer us all! This is our chance. Huh. Witness the avalanche! With me out here, how can we lose? Huh. Sinners, ready yourself for the judgment of eternal winter! Clemency? Never heard of it. The time is now. Pretty good crowd today. Keep up! My tempo! My turn! Right there while I give you a present! Gotta try hard sometimes. Check out this awesome move! You can't run! <laughs> You have the worst luck running into me. Fight it or rock with it. My music. Conquer us all! The world that they promised. <gasps> she disappeared. Those stairs. It's the only 
way forward. Wherever they lead, it must be the end of the journey. I don't want to get to the end so soon. I want my journey to go on forever. This means that Branya is up ahead. And so is the fate of the Overworld and the Underworld. It's all in our hands. <sighs> Strange. I thought I'd feel nervous or afraid, but I don't. The only feeling I have is that none of this seems real. Not always. Sometimes it's a happier conclusion. The Express has traveled world after world. We are merely passing travelers, witnesses to part of a grander story. We invariably avoid getting drawn into turbulence that can decide the fate of a world, but there are always times when we have no choice but to act. Or to put it another way, this is one heck of a first trailblazing expedition. You hit the jackpot. I was about to bore you all with my gloomy reflections, but, on second thought, not today. Adventuring with you guys by my side has made me feel like no obstacle is too big. Right on! But you can say whatever you like. A good adventure shouldn't be full of rules and regulations. Helping those in need, befriending those worth counting on, and saving the world a few times along the way.